The microchamber is a dynamic headspace unit and it's used to collect the VOCs that are emitted from products or materials. And what happens is, is you place a material inside the chamber and a flow of gas is applied. And the vapors are then swept from those materials onto a sampling tube. That sampling tube can either be a sorbent tube, which contains adsorbent material that traps specific compounds that are then analyzed by thermal desorption GCMS, or you can use uh, DMPH cartridges, typically for aldehyde analysis, which are then analyzed by um, HPLC. So not only can the microchamber be used to follow standardized methods for regulatory compliance, but it can also be used for things such as formulation and process analysis, research and development, and also comparing your product against a competitor's product. The typical types of markets that use uh, the microchamber are the building industry, the automotive industry, food and drink, toy manufacturers, furniture, also manufacturers of semiconductors and printed circuit boards for the computer industry. We also have customers that are looking at slightly more niche areas and they tend to be the research and university institutes looking at biogenics um, and human health. We use the microchamber in several sectors, in tissues, in diapers, in different kinds of, kind of plastics and even in, in food uh, sector as well, in, in cheese sample, etc. Et the microchambers allowed us to increase the sensitivity. It's uh, to studying the interaction between plants and insects, and in my case also microorganisms. We mainly use the microchamber for emission testing of automotive components. The microchamber is often used instead of other emission sampling techniques for quick analysis of materials. The multiple chambers inside the system um, and the smaller size of them allow much faster and more efficient ways of sampling and collecting of those compounds of interest. As an engineering service provider, we have an interest in supporting our customers in developing their materials and the microchamber is a very good tool for fulfilling this task. I use microchamber uh, for emission tests, parts used in uh, automotive industry like uh, plastics, uh, rubbers, uh, upholstery materials, phones. I use microchamber uh, because I think it's generally short analysis time. Frequently we have um, questions of customers of us asking for the reasons or the, the sources of emittents they have obtained in other methods and they would like to know what exactly is the origin of this substance. And uh, the microchamber helped us to find answers to these questions by using this instrument on sample material which was not possible before. An important feature of the microchamber is that this device is really easy to use. Not only does Marx manufacture the microchamber, but we're also the world leaders in thermal desorption. And this combination of these two techniques is so powerful. It allows you to look at the VOCs and SVOCs emitted from a range of materials over a really wide range of industries.